so our assignment topic is distance vector and link state routing created by Swati Safle, Tanuja Varghis and Yashasvi Vankhede. Talking about distance vector routing algorithm, this is one of the two major class of intra-domain routing algorithms. The other one is link state routing. Distance vector routing protocol use the Bellman Ford algorithm, Ford Fulcuration alg alg algorithm to calculate paths. Definition a distance vector routing algorithm operates by having each router maintain a table that is a vector giving the best known distance to each destination and which link to use to get there. These tables are updated by exchanging information with the neighbors. Eventually, every router knows the best link to reach each de destination. It was the original ARPANET routing algorithm and was also used in the internet under the name routing information protocol. The routing is assumed to know the distance to each of its neighbors. If the metric is hops, the distance is just one hop. If the metric is propagation delay, the router can measure it directly with special echo packets that the receiver just time steps and sends back as fast as it can. Talking about Bellman Ford algorithm. Bellman Ford algorithm is used to find the shortest path from a single source vertex to all other vertices of the structure in a graph. The graph used in a weighted di digraph, basically a weighted directed graph, also called Bellman Ford Murray algorithm because Edward F. Murray also published the same algorithm in 1957. This is an example of it. The ma major drawback of this protocol is the count to infinity pro problem. This problem includes networks using distance vector routing which are sus susceptible to loops and issues with count to infinity. Problems can happen with your routing protocol when a link or a router fails. Basically, unreachable nodes in a divided network. This is an example of it. Now, talking about link state routing, distance vector routing was used in the ARPANET until 1979. When it was replaced by link state routing, the primary problem that caused its demise was that the algorithm often took too long to converge after the network topology changed due to the count to infinity problem. Consequently, it was replaced by an entirely new algorithm now called link state routing. Variants of link state routing are called ICs and OSPF. These routing algorithms are most widely used inside large networks and the internet today. OSPF stands for Open Shortest Pass First and ISIS stands for Intermediate System to Intermediate System. This contrasts with distance vector which work by having each node share its routing table with its neighbors. In the link state protocol, the only information passed between nodes is connectivity related. Each router must do the following things to make it work. Discover its neighbors and learn their network addresses. Second, set the distance or cost metric to each of its neighbors. Third, construct a packet telling all it has just learned. Fourth, send this packet to and receive packets from all other routers. Compute the shortest to every other router. This process proceeds in two phases. First, node f nodes flood topology in the form of link state packets. Each node computes its own forwarding table by any shortest path finding algorithm. Phase 1, topology flooding. Each node floods link state packet that describes their portion of the topology. Phase 2, route computation. Each node has full topology by combining all LSPs. Each node simply runs DigExtra some replicated computation but finds required routes directly. Compile forwarding table form from sync source tree. That's it. One important terminology, forwarding table. This says about the next node in our journey towards the destination node. This is the example of a forwarding table. Updating after changes, link failure and node failure. In this case, we remove the old or failed node and the flood the link state packet and recompute routes. Nodes adjacent to the failed node will notice the change. 
there are certain problems we encounter first detection delay delay in detection of failure information sent into a black hole some routers will know about the disruptions before other because inconsistency tackle these problems by faster flooding smaller hello timers faster processors on routers thank you so much